cracks in brick, cracks in block, sticking windows or doors, settling or sinking foundation, it's a fact. Foundation problems don't get better with time, but they do get better when you call APS. It's the Weather Extreme video. This is the afternoon edition. This is for Friday the 10th of June. I'm James Spann. Strong to severe storms are pushing through southwest Alabama. As I do this update, lighter rain for the northern part of west Alabama. But the big story, it's the heat that's on the way. Here we go. This is the upper air look across the country today. Again, we have a northwest flow aloft and an MCS, mesoscale convective system, Pushing into West Alabama as the visible satellite view, high cirrus clouds cover much of the state. And that was the radar composite about 2.30. Heavier storms will be down in southwest Alabama. In fact, as I do this update, we've got severe thunderstorm warnings in effect now for parts of uh, Choctaw, Washington, and Clark counties in southwest Alabama. The rain is lighter to the north. Temperatures are not bad. Uh, 75 at Haleyville. 77 for Coleman, 83 at Birmingham. Those were captured at 130. Uh, but next week, we're going to be up in the 90s and around the region. A few spots hitting 90 down to the south. There is a, a severe thunderstorm watch for southwest Alabama. This is until 8 o'clock tonight. This is basically south of a line from near York to Selma, down to the Gulf Coast. And around the nation, heat advisories for much of Texas and also parts of the southwest U.S., Here's the severe weather outlook for the rest of today and tonight. Risks along the Gulf Coast with that MCS. The higher severe weather probabilities are over the southwestern counties of the state where that severe thunderstorm watch has been posted. This is tomorrow, a marginal risk well to the north of here across parts of the Great Plains. And day three, Sunday, again, risks well to the north. Day four, Monday, a chance of severe storms over parts of the Dakotas. Rain for the next seven days, really not much. Uh, what you see on this map, that's basically with that MCS going on now. Uh, after today, showers and storms should be very spotty during the afternoon hours through the weekend and much of next week. And the tropics remain very, very quiet. Model fans, here we go, the GFS. This is the 12Z run, valid tomorrow at 4. Got that 591 upper high to the west that will be nosing in here next week. And tomorrow looks pretty quiet, partly sunny, upper 80s. Showers should be few and far between. Same thing Sunday, low 90s as heat levels begin to rise. Monday, there might be a pop-up shower somewhere, but not many. We might be in the mid-90s on Monday. In fact, all week there's a chance of that. This is Tuesday, evidence, so we might see a slight increase in the number of scattered showers and storms then. Wednesday, just hot isolated showers same thing thursday and again for much of next week we'll be in the mid 90s it's going to be the hottest week so far this year and a week from today friday the 17th at 594 nasty heat ridge just west of here but that's nosing in here and again kind of hot kind of dry we'll go out 10 days monday june 20th again we've got the upper high nearby and a front north of the state but that probably will run out of gas before giving us much relief Rain for Birmingham off the GFS Ensemble between now and the 26th of June. Not much. The mean is a little over one inch. Of course, there's a lot of spread with the members. Some showing nothing, some showing four inches. And as typically the case in summer, your number will vary. And yeah, buddy, here comes the heat. 89 tomorrow after that will be in the 90s for a while. Latest CPC outlook. This is for June 18th through June 24th. We are solidly in the red meaning the ridge will likely hold and temperatures will likely stay above average. That's it for the Weather Extreme video this afternoon. We'll have notes on the blog. My next video posted here by 6 o'clock Monday morning. And if you can, join us this evening on ABC 3340 News at 4, 5, 6, and 10 o'clock. Thanks for watching. Have a great weekend and God bless. Cracks in brick. Cracks in block. Call Alabama Professional Services. Leaning or bowing basement walls. Call APS. Sticking windows or doors. Call APS. Settling or sinking foundation, that's right. Call APS. It's a fact. Foundation problems don't get better with time, but they do get better when you call APS. Call Alabama Professional Services today.